Welcome to part two of the Xeno Instant tutorial, creating an instant gallery on desktop and customizing features. I'm going to walk you through how to set up an instant gallery from A to Z and show you some popular features so you can share and sell your photos in real time. If you want to jump to a specific section of the video, here are some timestamps, but otherwise let's just get started. First, let's go to the Xeno Instant page. Navigate to cloud.zeno.com and under products, pick Xeno Instant. After logging in, you'll see the workspace icon. Click on that and enter the workspace. You'll see the entire Xeno Cloud dashboard. To enter Xeno Instant, click on Instant Galleries, and this is where you'll create your Instant Gallery. In tutorial part one, we showed you how to set up a test gallery. You should see that test gallery you created here. If you want to create a brand new Instant Gallery, click on the New Instant Gallery button in the top right corner. Before you continue, it's important to note that once you click Confirm on this page, that will consume one of your Instant Galleries. Go ahead and fill out a name for this Instant Gallery, and below this you can see how many Instant Gallery credits you have left. Let's start with the Basics tab. Just as the name suggests, you will enter the basic information for your Instant Gallery, such as the gallery name, event dates, time, and location. The basic information you enter will be visible to guests when they access the Instant Gallery. It's a good idea to customize the Instant Gallery URL to include your business name. The next tab is Style. You can customize the look and feel of the Instant Gallery. Most photographers add banners, customize text overlays, and background colors. You can also make the banner clickable by adding a URL. For example, let's add your studio website so guests might tap on it and visit your website. You can also add categories in your Instant Gallery. For example, if you're shooting a three-day conference, you could create three categories, day one, day two, and day three. That way, your guests can go to the desired categories to see photos taken on that day. If you want to see what your instant gallery looks like from the guest perspective on their phone, click on the preview button on the bottom left. This is what our current instant gallery looks like. The next tab is photo branding. If you're working with clients who want their logo or event branding on the photos, or you want your own studio branding, you can do that here. You can add your banner with the event name, date, location, a client logo, or your studio name so every photo feels on brand. We have pre-made templates you can use, or you can create your own custom design in the design tool of your choice. You can add a watermark to your photo. Either use a pre-designed watermark or upload your own. If you plan to sell your photos, it's important to add watermarks before you start taking photos and sharing them in real time. Now let me show you how to set access and permissions. This section is important because it determines how your guests will receive their photos. Choose the delivery method that fits your client's needs. Here are three options. The first option is password not required. This gives your gallery open access. The second option is set password if you want to add a layer of security. The third option is selfie check-in, also called selfie access. This method requires guests to upload a selfie and they'll only see the photos they appear in. For example, if the photographer took 2,000 images and guest A is in 50 of them, only those 50 of guest A will appear. Using data collection, you can collect names, email addresses, and phone numbers with both open access and selfie access. This is especially helpful for photographers who like to follow up with guests whether you want to send a quick thank you, share a link to the photos, or offer additional services. 
A popular feature inside of Open Access is automatically detect faces in photos, also known as face match. And this works inside an Open Access gallery. Guests will see a small face icon on any photo they appear in. Tapping it instantly pulls up all of their photos so they don't have to search through the entire gallery. At the bottom of this page, you can choose how guests download your photos. You can choose whether guests download a single photo or the full gallery or both. And you can decide if those downloads include your branding from the photo branding section or not. Next up is AI Retouch. This tab lets you automatically retouch all images before they land in your Instant Gallery. AI Retouch is the only paid add-on in Xeno Instant, and it's unlimited retouching for the individual gallery. There are no credits and no limits on how many photos you can retouch. You can choose from presets that are good for outdoor, indoor, and more, or use any of your own saved presets. And if the environment changes during your event, you can switch presets at any time. It's important to turn this on before the event so photos get retouched instantly. It won't edit photos automatically that were already uploaded to the Instinct Gallery. AI Culling. Our free built-in AI Culling automatically removes bad shots, closed eyes, blurry images, overexposed, underexposed, and duplicate images. The system handles everything in the background for you and it's completely free, built right in. I recommend keeping strictness between low and medium so you don't lose any great shots by accident. Make sure to turn this on before you begin taking photos. If you turn it on after you take your photos, it won't call anything. It has to be enabled beforehand so the images are filtered before they land in the Instant Gallery. Collaborator. If you're shooting an event with multiple photographers, you can use the Collaborator option so your additional photographers can send photos to your Instant Gallery simultaneously. All they need is the mobile tethering kit to follow the steps from part one of the tutorial and then you enter their email address in this box to add them as a collaborator. Store. If you're planning to sell digital photos, physical prints, or both, this is where you'll set up everything. Xeno Instant is zero commission, so 100% of the revenue goes to you. First, switch the store status to on. Next, let's set up your price sheet for your eStore. At the bottom of the page, you'll see the text, set up your price sheets here. Click that here hyperlink. This will open up the eStore setup page. Click the add price sheet button in the top right corner. Here you can pick a name for your price sheet. If you want Xeno to handle printing, choose automatic fulfillment. If you prefer using another lab, choose self-fulfillment. Inside the price sheet, you can set your pricing for digital downloads and physical products like acrylic, metal, canvas, and more prints. You can reuse the same price sheet across any of your instant galleries. If you're looking to sell digital downloads, hover over the photo download option and click it. From here, you can set prices for single photo downloads, full gallery downloads, and choose your pricing for different image sizes and quality levels. Next, you'll want to set up your payment settings. Go back to the eStore page, and in the Settings tab, you can connect your Stripe or PayPal account for automatic payments. All payments go straight to you, and Xeno Instant takes zero commission. You can also choose offline payments if you prefer to accept cash, checks, or other methods. You'll also find options for things like taxes, shipping, coupons, and other selling tools you can customize based on your business needs. The last step is to navigate back to the store tab of your Instant Gallery. Click on the price sheet drop down and choose the price sheet you just created. 
Now your instant gallery is ready to sell. Manage photos. For photographers who want to make manual changes to their images, this is where you'll do it. You can add, delete photos, download them, retouch them, organize everything into categories, and more. Next up is manage downloads. If you have a corporate client or anyone who needs to download all of the images at once, this is the easiest way to do it. Just generate the download file, copy the link, and email it over. It's important to know that you have three options for the types of photos you can deliver. You can generate a download link with the original photos, the retouched photos, or the photos that include your branding. The last section under activities is attendees. For the photographers that turned on data collections in access and permissions, trying to collect names, email addresses, and phone numbers, this is where that data will be available. In the top right of the page, you have two options, email attendees and export. You can email all guests directly from this page. It's helpful for sending a quick thank you or reminding people to check their photos. You can also use the export button to download all of your guest information into a file if you want to save it or upload it somewhere else. Down on the bottom left, you'll see the buttons for preview and share. Preview lets you see exactly what your gallery looks like as you are building it. The preview button also lets you watch your photos upload to the instant gallery as you're shooting. Share is where you'll get your QR code and your link to the Instant Gallery. Most photographers print the QR code out and place it around at their events so guests can scan it quickly. And that's it for part two of the Xeno Instant Tutorial. You now have everything you need to set up your Instant Gallery and walk into your next event ready to go.